Yo, welcome back to another video. I'm so sorry it's been a long minute since the end of the video. I do want to say one thing before I get started. This might sound but I'm sorry. My main mic that I've always used for a lot of my videos is um, not really working right now for some reason. But I'm getting a new one very soon. So next video, it uh, won't be this mic. This is the same mic I'm using for my audio. It's the same mic I'm using for the mic. So my bad. But anyways, I'm going to show you how to get a custom uh, like Discord icon on desktop. You know you can do it on phone, but I'm gonna show you how to do it on your desktop too. Uh, just, just something, something, something. So, basically, is what I mean by icons like this. Like, you no, know, I normally describe icon is not like this. It's like a regular blue default. But I'm gonna show you how to get a custom one. So, first of all, make sure y'all got y'all's logo. Um, or if y'all don't got one, I'll leave this website in description. You can make, you can mess around with it, mess around with it, make it your own. But if you're going to use this site, make sure to put it on round. Don't put it on full or none. Put it on round. But since I have my own, I really don't need this, but I will, like I said, for people who don't have it, you can just make one. Um, or if you have one, but it, it's, it's like, it's big, like, like... Um, like it's not like a regular small one. You can always just open it and then you can resize it to fit in there. But once you got that done, you photo PL, I'll, I'll leave this link in the description too. Make sure no new project, Instagram, make sure it's on white background, create. Now, make sure you hit transform, uh, transform controls. It basically just helps you move around, uh, Oh my God, bro. I hate when it does this. Hopefully it only does it to me, not to y'all. But when y'all get in there, this just helps it zoom in and out. Make sure this is zoomed all the way in. Well, my quality is not the best, but it's okay. All right, bro. All right, dude. So once I got that, go down here and select this rectangle. And just do this. Doesn't matter if it's perfect or not. Because once you got that, all you're going to do is hold down shift and just. You're just going to move it. And then boom, once that's done, what you're going to do, move this up here. Clip and mask. Oh, I'm so dumb. Good choice. Just go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. What you're gonna do is you're gonna click these three lines right here. Make sure it's still selected this. Highlight this and put 200. Press enter. All right. After that, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna, just gonna drag this up. You can drag this down or above. Don't matter. Right click, clip and mask, and then boom, you got this. Now you can. Um, before you clip and mask. Uh, never mind. Clip and mask. And just. A little bit okay. So once I got that, uh, go ahead, go to file, go to export as more dot ico and redo these to two five six, and then once you got that, go ahead and hit save. And then boom. I think my desktop down in the CTB. Alright, now once y'all got that saved, you don't really need this no more. So what you do need is it's right here. Right click. So properties. This is for the show the desktop right here. Change the icon, browse, and then go to right here. Okay, apply. You can see it changed right there. So now we're going to, when you search up Discord, it's still gonna show this one. So make sure just hit open file location. Right click, somewhere properties, properties. Do the same thing, icon, boom. Okay, apply, okay, so I in the background. And then boom, so if, it, if it's linked here, if it's, here to taskbar, just unpin it. If it hasn't changed your taskbar, and then just repin it. 
and then it should have that logo. That's how you do it. Uh, hope y'all enjoyed this little tutorial, something. And um, leave in the comments what y'all want to see, like what videos y'all want to see, because I really do need help, to be honest. Um, more things coming to the future. Better things. Um, waiting to get a new PC to stream, just because the PC is not, this PC is really not good for streaming. It's just good for gaming, simple games. But, if you enjoyed the video, out. Peace.